Hello, I'm Jordan from Wyance. Today, we will learn about the center of gravity, and we will also conduct a simple experiment on the center of gravity. The center of gravity is the magnetic flux of gravity, force acting on each part of the object. In other words, when an object is suspended or supported in a certain place, it is leveled and balanced. The center of gravity is related to the position of the object. And if there is a center of gravity on the top of the object, the object becomes very unstable and prone to collapse. But if the center of gravity is at the bottom of the object, it's stable and doesn't fall down easily. Also, when you play this woodblock stacking game, understanding the center of gravity, rather than just piling it up, you can pack more woodblocks higher Occasionally, you've seen a stone pagoda piled up by someone on the beach, which also hides the principle of science called center of gravity. You're looking at a stroller standing on its chin. The center of gravity of the stroller is concentrated a lot at the top. If the center of gravity is concentrated on the upper side, the person can move the center point by themselves and zero it to stop the stroller. Now, let's do an experiment on the center of gravity together. Teacher Wyans will proceed. Find the center of gravity of a meter. What is the center of gravity of a meter? Assuming you fold the ruler in half, the center of gravity is the center of the fold. Find the center of gravity of the bars with different weights at both ends. I'll bite the tongs to increase the weight of the stick. Put the stick on top of your fingers. If you put your two fingers together, the part where the two fingers meet is the center of gravity. Find the center of gravity of the plastic can. A plastic can, water. Prepare food coloring. Drop a few drops of food coloring into a plastic can and pour some water. Let's focus on the plastic can. Find the center of gravity of the paper dragon flea. Here's a picture of a dragon flea. Can you believe it if you put a dragon flea picture on your fingertips? I'll cut the dragon flea picture. I'll fold the picture in half. Fold it so that the dragon flea's picture is in the middle. Then follow the drawing and cut it with scissors. Let's put the dragon flea on our fingertips. What do you think? You'll see the dragonflies fall out of balance. I'll put the two clips on the wings. And I'll put it on my fingertips. The dragonflies are holding their center of gravity and hanging on their fingertips. I'll put it on the scissors too. You're looking at him holding his balance well. Today, we learn it about the center of gravity. If you like the video, subscription, I'd love to. Notification settings, please. I'll see you in the next video.